society makes us think that if we want to be successful in life, we have to be busy and productive all day from the moment we wake. I used to have a toxic relationship with productivity. I felt external pressure to always be productive, especially as a medical student, leaving me feeling burnt out. But it doesn't have to be that way. everyone watching this, don't do things just because others say you should. Instead, find a balance in your life and learn to enjoy the journey. Hello. I'm a little sick right now, so excuse the nasal congestion. I hope you enjoyed that film I made with Owen. I'm quite sure a lot of my viewers know who Owen is, but for those who don't, this is Owen. He's in my UNSW medicine cohort. We met back in year one, and since then he's been a great friend of mine. He promised to do a vlog with me sometime. Oh so, yeah. Um, we will probably do a collaboration. He makes YouTube videos as well, so you should definitely go check out his channel because he's got some pretty sick content there. Hey Brandon! You can introduce yourself man. I'm Ken. I'm from Hong Kong. Yes. Here we decided to take a drive down to Royal National Park and the plan was to do cliff jumping at Guatemala Beach. It's not too bad. Yeah, it's not too bad. Yeah. Unfortunately, the surf rescue was there and by right, you're not supposed to be doing cliff jumping there so we didn't want to take the risk of getting into trouble so we just decided not to do any cliff jumping, unfortunately. We won't jump now, but we'll try again later. Yeah, but anyway, this place is really nice and beautiful and then we're just gonna enjoy this place. Still though, we had a pretty chill time at Guatemala Beach and soon after, we wanted to start one of the hikes there. Unfortunately, the moment we wanted to start the hike, it started pouring and we just thought there was no way we could do the hike now. At that point, Ken offered to drive us up to a lookout point and we were like, might as well, right? Yeah, it's raining pretty bad right now. I guess we can't go on the hike. But we're gonna drive to another lookout spot, so hopefully we see something good there. When we got there, the wind was so strong and the rain was so hard and we were just freezing in the car. <laughs> yeah, I, I think we can just see like how it goes. So right now, we are in like a dilemma because the weather is obviously very good <laughs> and it's too good that we can't go out because we're probably gonna get some burnt. But right now, I think the best plan is to get a hot dog and get some ice cream. Hot and dog and just ice cream. Yeah. yeah, look at the people. Look at how, how happy they are right now. <laughs> Wow, look at this uncle. Yeah. <laughs> like doing a selfie. Oh, shit. Oh. Do you look at the mountains? It's so nice. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, it's raining so bad. And we're freezing. <laughs> How's your hot dog? Um, pretty good. No, actually, appreciate it. I'm not lying. <laughs> um, but at least, it's, at least it's something warm. And unfortunately, the hot dogs and ice cream were not that good at all. So at that point, I'm thinking like, the video is completely ruined, right? Because we wanted to go cliff jumping, but we couldn't. And then we wanted to go on a hike, and then we couldn't. And everything was just looking really down. And that was when the sky slowly started to open up. And wow, the views there were just absolutely incredible. And I guess the takeaway from that day was that Life may not always go according to plan, but just learn to enjoy the journey and always look on the positive side of things. Yeah, 
Alright, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave it a like and a comment and consider subscribing. Have a great week, guys.